Hey there, story lovers. Welcome back to another thrilling chapter of our tale. Today, we're diving into chapter three, where the sun sets over Lancaster, casting a golden hue that signals the start of the much-anticipated Harvest Festival. The air is alive with excitement as townsfolk bustle about, setting up stalls adorned with vibrant pumpkins and colorful banners. The laughter of children echoes through the square, mingling with the sweet scent of caramel apples. But beneath this festive atmosphere, there's a deeper story waiting to unfold. So, buckle up as we journey through the heart of Lancaster and uncover the secrets that lie beneath the surface. As the sun dips below the horizon, casting a golden hue over Lancaster, Lily Harper stands at the edge of the town square. Her heart races as she watches the townsfolk bustling about, setting up stalls adorned with vibrant pumpkins and colorful banners. The laughter of children echoes, mingling with the sweet scent of caramel apples. Yet, Lily feels a heaviness in her chest, a reminder of the shadows that loom over her past. Enter Maya Chun, with her spiky hair reflecting the fiery colors of autumn. Maya approaches Lily, her eyes sparkling with excitement. Are you ready for tonight? Maya asks, her voice a blend of enthusiasm and concern. Lily forces a smile, but the knot in her stomach tightens. Tonight is not just about celebration. It's about confronting the truth that has haunted her since Mr. Thompson's death. Jake Sullivan stands a few paces away, fiddling with a strand of hay. His rugged build contrasts sharply with the delicate atmosphere of the festival. He has been a reluctant ally, his initial resentment towards Lily slowly morphing into a fragile camaraderie. As their eyes meet, a silent understanding passes between them. They are both grappling with their own demons, yet bound by a shared purpose. As twilight descends, the festival transforms. Lanterns flicker to life, illuminating the square with a warm glow. But Lily feels the chill of Mr. Thompson's ghost lurking nearby. The whispers of the past echo in her mind, urging her to seek the truth. With each step towards the center of the square, memories flood back. His laughter, his guidance, and the weight of his legacy that now rests on her shoulders. The festival's opening ceremony begins, and the mayor's voice booms through the crowd. But Lily's focus is elsewhere. She can feel the presence of Mr. Thompson, a shadowy figure at the periphery of her vision, urging her to confront the guilt that has shackled her for too long. You must let go, Lily. The ghost seems to whisper, his voice a haunting melody that resonates deep within her. As the festivities unfold, Lily's resolve strengthens. She will not allow fear to dictate her life any longer. With Maya and Jake by her side, she steps forward, ready to unveil the secrets that have bound her to the past. The truth awaits, and with it, the promise of redemption and the chance to embrace the vibrant future that Lancaster has to offer. And there you have it, folks, another chapter filled with suspense and emotion. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join us next time on Storyteller for more adventures.